praise God our viewers. We thank the Lord for this day. It is another day. Amen, amen. And we welcome you to our broadcast today. Welcome. Welcome very much. Yes. Today as we are going to begin this broadcast mm -hmm. or this live session. Oh, yes. And God will bless you. Please, Pastor, please pray for us. Okay, let us believe in prayer. Father Lord, in Jesus' name, yes, we come before thee, Lord. Yes. We say thank you for this hour of the night. Yes. You have helped us, my Father, throughout. Yes. And now we are about to start the broadcast. Yes, Lord. We pray that Jehovah, you be with us, my Lord. Yes. Give us your attention because you are the Lord. Mm -hmm. Give us, Lord, your spirit mm -hmm. to help us to lead us from the start. Yes. Till we finish, my Father. Yes. And we believe it is done. Mm -hmm. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray as we believe. Amen. 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 Yeah, so our viewers, I want to greet you again in Jesus' name. Yes. I I want to believe you are right, you are well, and then it's uh, another time that we have come to broadcast together. Yes. And we want to, as well, know more about Jesus Christ. Yes. So we have to talk uh, about the church. I see, I know you have seen about the church, and now it is the time to know what is the church. Mm -hmm. Yes. What is the church? Yes. Yes. And we are going to read from the book of us for first Corinthians chapter three verse sixteen. Yes. To know what is a church. And before we, we start, mm -hmm. Pastor, I wanted to, to request you to tell us. Yes. Why is that you have given them <laughs> <laughs> about uh, the best church in the world? Yes. I believe people or we people have been looking to find the best church where we can worship our God or where we can we can clean it to be so clean or we can build it to be so beautiful before the eyes of men mm -hmm. or we can use all our creativity and everything to invest in that church mm -hmm. so that you may see God or so that you may worship God. Mm -hmm. So I, I, I thought of this and I saw that this there's a church that God himself wants. Yes. And there's a church where Jesus used to, to, to tell people to go to it. Yes. He used to tell, like the woman, like that woman in the well, mm. she was shown the way and she was given the, a church. Mm. Even though we can say that she was not taken to our church, mm. like in, but Jesus gave her a church. Amen. So many people were given churches. Even yes. Nicodemus, they were, he was shown the way to the church. Mm. So even for us in the whole world, yeah. there is, should be a specific church mm. given to us human beings where we should worship our God or where we should do, we should clean maybe. So, so today we want to know who is his the church. Amen, amen. Yes. So viewers, I understand according to the way Pastor is explaining to me, yes, and to us, mm -hmm. is uh, that we don't compare God with the houses. Yes. Uh, because I believe there is church mm -hmm. and there is building. Yes. And here, my, maybe you, a few, maybe you are thinking about a building. Mm -hmm. Because if you say the best church in the world, mm -hmm. maybe they think of cathedral. Yes. Or the, the of mega churches, yes. uh, church churches, mm -hmm. well, 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 well built churches, well built churches. Mm -hmm. So we are not talking about the buildings. Yes. We are talking about the church. The church. And you have to know what is the church. Yes. Not the building. Mm -hmm. You want to know what is the church. Yes. And uh, I know according to the word of God, we will know the meaning the of the church yes. because we have with the meaning of the church. Mm -hmm. so, yes. Okay, we are going to read from the book of First Corinthians chapter 3, verse 16. Mm -hmm. And it says, Don't you realize that all of you together are the temple of God mm -hmm. and the Spirit of God lives in you? Mm -hmm. God will destroy anyone who destroys his temple. Mm -hmm. For God's temple is holy and you are that temple. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So we get that picture uh, that uh, the church... Yes. Is, uh, is, uh, is us, yeah. our bodies. Yes, and first we have been told, mm -hmm. don't you realize that you, that all of you together are the temple of God and that the Spirit of God lives in you? Amen. 
don't we realize that we are the church we are the church yes we are the temples we are the church mm -hmm. and the spirit of god lives in us yes and god says anyone who destroys his temple mm -hmm. so there is that temple that you can destroy yeah maybe when you compare my body with that so-called building yes. which we may refer it as a church mm -hmm. but it is not before the eyes of god mm -hmm. as a church yes. because he has shown us the right church mm -hmm. or the correct church mm -hmm. which is me and you yes. and our viewers mm -hmm. everyone is a church mm -hmm. so i believe to say that anyone who destroys that temple mm -hmm. or that church mm -hmm. and god destroys that person, person. Amen. so how do we destroy this church amen so our viewers, mm -hmm. we, we, we also uh, come to understand Amen. that we are the church. Yes. The church is about us, yes. not that the building we go. Yes. And here, mm. Pastor, I think uh, some many people think that mm. I am to, I'm going to wait on the date of the Sunday mm -hmm. or Saturday day. Yes. Or Saturday day, whichever the case, mm -hmm. uh, because I have seen a lot of people uh, cooperating to each other yes. or discussing or trying to chat yes. or trying to debate about the church, yes. the, the good day to go to church. Yes. There are others who go on, on the Sabbath, mm -hmm. they, they, they say they go in the, in the day of Saturday, Saturday yes. and others they will go to the church on Sunday. Yes. And then sometimes there is a, there's a big, very big debate mm -hmm. and a lot of uh, arguments yes. that your day is not a good day, mm -hmm. our day is a good day. Yes. So we have to see that the Lord is talking about the church. the church and he say mm -hmm. human beings are the church yes. are the temple of the lord mm -hmm. and then they say the spirit of god dwells, dwells in that church yes so we have to understand here our viewers yes. according to the word of god mm -hmm. church is not that house yes it's not that building mm -hmm. church is you is me mm -hmm. so viewers uh i think if i am the church yes. there's something lord is warning or is telling us not to do, mm -hmm. to destroy the temple. Mm -hmm. So how comes that I destroy my te the temple of the Lord? Mm -hmm. uh, so we have to go on deeper. Yes. And then we are, we start to see, I am start, I'm, I'm starting to see mm -hmm. deeper things. Yes. Like what? Mm -hmm. We are not supposed to take that date. Mm -hmm. We go to that house. Mm -hmm. as a special day than others. Yes. If I am the temple of the Lord, mm -hmm. even on my bed, yes. I have the same, same temple. Yes. On, temple. on my work, yes. I am the temple of the Lord. Yes. On the way walking, mm -hmm. I'm the temple of the Lord. Amen. Inside my tattoo, um, yes. a vehicle, yes. driving, mm. working, yes. I must remain a temple of the Lord. Amen. So the Lord is saying, if you destroy the temple, I will also destroy you. You see? Yes. So the Lord the Lord says, mm -hmm. if you want to say you know God, yes. or rather you are saved, mm -hmm. or rather you are a believer, yes. that believer does not, uh, uh, God does not uh, determine because determine you because yeah, he's not he's not determined by going to the church. Mm -hmm. So the Lord will know his believer because he is giving that temple holy. Mm -hmm. He is not destroying the temple. Or oh, maybe maybe someone can ask. Mm. But why do pastors always tell us we have a building? Oh, we are building this cathedral for God, and we build it really referring it as for God. God's That's house. God and. And someone also say, I'm going to secure this place. This this place, no one should step this place because it is holy, because God dwells in this area. Or maybe there is somewhere which there is a gate you should not pass there because God dwells there. And okay, others well, are told, when you come to church, just mm -hmm. pour yourself down because the Spirit of God is here or God is here. That one, is, that one is a contradiction, yes. and uh, that is a lack of knowledge. Mm -hmm. Remember the Bible tells us, yes. my people perish because of lack of knowledge. Yes. So those pastors who are, are saying there is a special place, uh, for instance, mm -hmm. there is a space there uh, in the blood of the church mm -hmm. called Halter. Yes. Or, and that is where people are, 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 are told, mm -hmm. bring your, your sacrifice mm -hmm. on the Halter. Yes. That is a mistake, very big mistake. Because God does not dwell in altars. Mm -hmm. In the first, uh, in the first, in uh, the time of, uh, of of the law of Moses, mm -hmm. okay, that altar was uh, had a meaning. Mm -hmm. But today, after Jesus came, mm -hmm. there is no that meaning again. Yes. And I think you, we can read on the book of uh, 
Hebrews, mm-hmm. Hebrews chapter 9, then from verse number 1. So that you can get that, that clean picture. Hebrews chapter 9, verse number 1. Yes, from verse number 1 uh, downwards. It says, uh-huh. that first commandment between God and Israel had regulations for worship and a place a place of worship here on earth. Hallelujah. Yes. So the, the Bible is saying mm. the first worship, the first, uh, the first what? The first covenant. The first covenant. Between God and Israel. Yeah, that is the covenant of Moses. Yes. That covenant. Mm. The covenant of the law. Yes. Because Jesus came mm-hmm. and uh, that covenant yes. was very weak. Yes. That's where we are told it had regulations. Yes. For, regulations for worship. For worship. And, and the place. Yeah. Of worship here on earth. The first, that's what you the first, meaning yes. there is a second one. Yes. So the first covenant mm-hmm. between God and Israel mm-hmm. had regulations for worship and place of worship here worship on earth. Here yes. on earth. Mm-hmm. So we are told there were certain places which was uh, uh, kept apart mm-hmm. for worship. And that place was the co- it, it was the covenant between Jesus and uh, God and his Israelites. Mm-hmm. So he says, there were legularities. Yes. Legularities. Mm-hmm. These which were planned, mm-hmm. you must do this yes. on a certain time. Yes. You must bring this mm-hmm. at a certain place. Yes. But today, mm-hmm. that one is how? Yes. Continues because the Lord will tell us about mm-hmm. the second covenant. There were two rooms in that tabernacle. Mm-hmm. In the first room were a lampstand, a table, and, and sacred loaves of bread Amen. on the table. Okay. Uh, Pastor, mm-hmm. I want to say this. Mm-hmm. If uh, today's tabernacle mm-hmm. is correct one, according to the law of Moses, mm-hmm. so we must see those breads. They are, they are in front of the church. If mm-hmm. it is a tabernacle, mm-hmm. we must see all these things which were there mm-hmm. in the first covenant. A lampstand, uh-huh. a table, and a sacred loaf. There must sacred be. Of yeah, bread. I had another pastor uh, trying to mislead the church, mm-hmm. say, telling them, mm-hmm. you know there are breads here. But they are seen by the ones who have spiritual eyes. You know that nonsense. <laughs> yes. He was saying that. Mm-hmm. But uh, viewers, mm-hmm. I want to tell you uh, frankly and clean. Yes. There is nothing like tambanako today. Mm-hmm. Because according to the word of God, mm-hmm. listen for yourselves. Yes. Continue with it. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. This room was called the most holy place. I don't know whether to you are in your churches there is most high praise. Mm-hmm. I don't know whether in the churches of today, mm-hmm. even if they build a, a altar mm-hmm. of which type, mm-hmm. there is no holy place. Yes. There is nothing like that. Mm-hmm. It's just some uh, building mm-hmm. and they they keep aside some area. Mm-hmm. They call altar. And they say you must come to the altar call mm-hmm. uh, with the sacrifice. Mm-hmm. You must remove your shoes. You must kneel down. Mm-hmm. And men are a lot of regulation, regulations, mm-hmm. regularities. Yes. And God is saying mm-hmm. there were regularities in the first covenant, yes. whereby it was uh, the place was called Tabernacle, and you, you, you uh, they were used to go there. Mm-hmm. Uh, there, there was some places, only place, and continue. The room was called the most holiest place. The most holiest place. Yes. Mm-hmm. In that room mm-hmm. were a gold incense mm-hmm. altar. Mm-hmm. And a wooden chest called Ark of the Covenant. There was also Ark of the Covenant. Yes. Today's churches, mm-hmm. I don't know whether, sister, you have gone to the church and then you you, you, have, you found all these things. No. They are not there. Mm-hmm. It's about this, uh, uh, whatever, uh, this uh, linen cross. Mm-hmm. They are just hung somewhere. Mm-hmm. And then there is just a, a pro. And then the pastor stands there mm-hmm. at the full feet. There's nothing else. But yeah. according to the law, mm-hmm. these things were, they, they were supposed to be there. Yes. These were regularities. Mm-hmm. And today there are no regularities. Though we maintain to, to say and to lie to the church mm-hmm. that this is outer. Yes. Continue. Mm-hmm. Verse 3. Mm-hmm. Then there was a curtain, and behind. Mm-hmm. Let us begin here. Mm-hmm. This room was called Holy Place. Yeah. Then there was a curtain, and behind the curtain was the second room called the most holy place. So the first one was called holy place. And the, and the second one, the, one most is the most holy place. And in other behind language, the curtain. In other uh, translation, they, they call it Holy of Holies. Holy of Holies. So today I don't know I don't know whether mm. behind the curtains in the church mm. there is a room there. There's no room. 
the, it is a wall. In that building. Yeah, in that building. Yes. I don't know whether there is another room called the Most Holy or the Holy of Holies. Mm -hmm. So we just it is just a wall mm -hmm. and then curtains. Mm -hmm. So behind the curtain is a wall. Yes. But according to the law of Moses, mm -hmm. behind the curtain, there were another room mm -hmm. known as Holy of Holies. Holies. Continue. Uh -huh. Verse 4. Mm -hmm. In that room yes. were a gold incense altar and a wooden chest called Ark of the Covenant, mm -hmm. which was covered with gold on all sides. Inside the ark were a gold jar containing manna, Aaron's staff that sprouted leaves, and, uh, and the stone tablets of the covenant. Mm -hmm. above, the, above the ark were a cherubim mm -hmm. of divine glory, mm -hmm. whose wings stretched out over the earth over mm -hmm. uh -huh. the place of atonement, mm -hmm. but we cannot explain, explain these things in detail now. Amen. Yes. So there were many things. Yes. There were many things. Mm -hmm. There were many regularities. Mm -hmm. Continue to that we cannot know the regularities. Mm -hmm. Verse 6. Mm -hmm. When these things were all in place, mm -hmm. the priest regularly entered the first room mm -hmm. as they prepared as they performed their religious duties, but only the high priest entered the most holy place and only once a year. So that was the kind of worship mm. they used to worship God. Mm. So at, at that time, yes. God was not dwelling inside them. Yes. He, they, they had to, to worship him in a certain regularity. Mm. And then he, uh, the presence of God uh, used to come to, come yes. to the church or to, the, to that house. Mm. To that area, that, uh, uh, that room. To that room. Mm -hmm. But now today, mm -hmm. we don't have that room. Today we have our heart, mm -hmm. our bodies mm -hmm. as the temple. Mm -hmm. And the Lord dwells inside us. Mm -hmm. So everyone has the power to access God mm -hmm. inside his heart. Yes. Continue. Uh -huh. At, uh, he entered only once in a year. Yeah. And he always offered blood for his own sins and for the sins of the people had had committed in ignorance mm -hmm. by these regulations the holy spirit revealed that the entrance of the most high place was not freely open as long as the tabernacle and system it presented were still in use this is an illustration pointing to the present time Mm -hmm. For the gifts and sacrifices that the priests offer are not able to cleanse the conscience of the people mm -hmm. who bring them. For, for that old system deals only with food and drinks and various cleansing ceremonies, physical regulations that were in effect only until a better system could be established. Amen. Amen. So we are told the old, old tabernacle. The covenant, yes. whereby people used to go to the tabernacle, yes. and there was an altar mm. which had two rooms yes. the holy place yes. and the most the holy place, place yes. or the holy of holies. Mm. So we can see that regularity, yes. they had to do that to appease God. Mm. That spirit may come and talk, Amen. may come and talk to the, to the congregation. Yes. But today, yeah. that one is not happening mm. because before Jesus came, those regularities were working. Those physical things were undone. But today you see pastors carrying sticks. They say it is it belongs to the Moses, the Lord of Moses. Others are, 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 are calling sword of Elisha. They are doing many things. Yes. Whereby they were undone in the time of law. Mm. But today, Lord Himself mm. entered into our hearts. Yes. And now everybody is supposed to do what? Mm. To accept Jesus as his personal savior. Yes. That's why we say accept Jesus to be your personal savior. Mm. Personal savior mm -hmm. means he will save every individual personally. personally. The spirit of God will enter unto you mm -hmm. because you are the temple of the Lord. Yes. And the Lord wants to dwell inside the, us. The room now. The, the, that room. room. the room is now. Now we, we became the room. Mm -hmm. That this core room yes. is not accounted again. Yes. Yes. Continue uh, 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 number 11. 11. So Christ has now become the high priest over all the good things that have come. He has entered the he has entered the greater more more perfect tabernacle in heaven 
which was not made by human hands mm -hmm. and is not part of this created world. Yes. With his own blood, mm -hmm. not the blood of goats mm -hmm. and the calves, mm -hmm. he, he entered the most holy place once for all time and secured our redemption forever. Amen. Amen. So we are told yes. through Jesus Christ's blood, or through the death of Jesus Christ. Yes, he has become the... Yeah, he cleansed everybody. Yes. He entered there. He became the high priest. The high priest. And now no other priest will enter there for anybody. Amen. Nobody will enter there for their believers. Yes. Believers come to church mm -hmm. to be taught the word of God, mm -hmm. the ways of God, to be corrected of their mistakes, yes. to be taught this the way. Mm -hmm. And now, as you see today, we pastors mm -hmm. have uh, changed the word of God. And then we have, we are, we are still standing in the place of the those high priests of the uh, uh, covenant or the covenant, yes. and we are in the new covenant mm -hmm. where Jesus we are told Jesus entered once in the most holy mm -hmm. place. Mm -hmm. He entered once yes. and for all, oh. and then he, through entering there, mm -hmm. through his blood and his death, he we were cleansed. Yes. Everybody is is made holy by the blood of Jesus, yes. not by those altars, mm -hmm. not by those uh, sacrifices. Yes. Jesus was became one sacrifice by one once and for all. Mm -hmm. So we are told the blood of the, of the goat mm -hmm. and sheep yes. now are not worthy, mm -hmm. but the blood of Jesus was worthy only once. Mm -hmm. So how can we tell the the, 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 the viewers mm -hmm. they come with the sacrifice onto the altar, they bring the sacrifices for that, their they, they sins will they, they be, they be forgiven. That one is a lie. It is a lie. That one is misleading the church. And the church is not uh, the building. Yes. The church is human beings. Yes. That is a complication. Hallelujah. Amen. So, continue where we were. We were in the first Corinthians. Yes. Chapter 3, verse number uh, 15. First Corinthians. 15. Yes. We were there. Leave it again. And as we continue, viewers, uh, if you are hearing us, you are getting us well, if the point is coming well, yes. uh, can you please notify? We want to know whether we are, you are getting us uh, well. Yes. So, make sure that... Uh, at least tell us the way the the, 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 the broadcasting is mm -hmm. comment share like and subscribe make sure you subscribe so that we can continue uh connecting to each other every day yes amen okay first corinthians chapter 3 verse 16 yes don't you realize that all of you together are the temple of god the lord has said don't you realize all of you mm -hmm. So not some people. Yes. Everybody. All of you. Everybody, everybody must be the temple yeah, yes. of the Lord. Yes. Everybody. And we are told in the Hebrews, mm. Jesus, mm -hmm. uh, through his blood on the cross, mm -hmm. he was made the high priest. Yes. And then he cleansed. He paid. He paid for the price yes. for everyone yes. to become holy. Mm. So we are cleansed by the blood of the Lord Jesus Christ, mm. so that we can access God. Access the power of God. Yes. Access everything about God. No, it is it is not what what he says that the curtains were cut. In. Were cut. Yes. The curtain was. Uh, yes. No, it is those the curtains that you've been told. Yeah. There was a curtain that was. It was it torn. Yeah. It it yes. it torn yes. into two parts. Yes. Yeah. Torn. So everyone can see what is happening there in the most. Behind the curtain. Yes. So everybody who will humble before the Lord. Mm -hmm. Not pastors who know God than, than believers. Yes. It is the only who mm -hmm. fears the Lord. Yes. Who knows God a lot. Yes. It is the one who fears the Lord. Mm -hmm. That is the person who God wants. Yes. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of the wisdom. Yeah. So we have to know that uh, if you want to say you know the Lord, mm -hmm. you must become the church. Amen. And how do we become the how how do how, how do we become the church? Mm -hmm. It is the time we believe in Jesus Christ, mm -hmm. who made the way through his blood. To, to, for everyone to access God. Yes. And then he made us the temple where he has to dwell. He dwells. Amen. Okay. Mm -hmm. And the Spirit of God lives in you. Mm -hmm. God will destroy anyone who destroys his temple. Mm -hmm. For God's temple is holy and you are the temple. Amen. Amen. So the Lord says also another word of holiness. Yes. And he says that, uh, he says that Every somebody, every 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 every, every person yes. must be holy mm. because God is holy, yes. and he must keep the temple holy. Mm. So we want to 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 to, to know uh, how is to destroy the temple of the Lord. Yes. 
I, I would like to, to, to show that you can read on the book of First Corinthians, yes. chapter 6. Uh, I wish you, you can start in verse number 15. 15? Yes. Okay, 15. Oh, number uh, 12. 12. Mm -hmm. No, no, number 15. Yes, 15. Then I think it's 12. Okay. Uh -huh. First Corinthians chapter 6, Six. verse 12. Yeah. You say I am allowed to do anything, mm -hmm. but not everything is good for you. Mm -hmm. And and even though I am allowed to do anything, mm -hmm. I must not become a slave to anything. Mm -hmm. You say food was made for the stomach mm -hmm. and the stomach for food. Mm -hmm. This is true. Though someday God will do away with both of them. Mm -hmm. But you can't say that your bodies were made for sexual immorality. Mm -hmm. They were made for the Lord mm -hmm. and the Lord cares about our bodies. Hallelujah. And God will raise us from the dead mm -hmm. by his power mm -hmm. just as he raised our Lord from the dead. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we are told because the Lord had said mm -hmm. we are the temple of the Lord. Yes. And whoever destroys the temple, mm -hmm. God will destroy that person. Yes. And then further, he says, mm -hmm. uh, we must know mm -hmm. our bodies mm -hmm. are not meant for sex. Yes. They are meant to worship the Lord, yes. to glorify the Lord. Yes. So he has told us in some part, mm -hmm. uh, sexual sin mm -hmm. destroys the temple of the Lord. Lord. You see, yes. so we must glorify the Lord with our bodies. But we see now in the world of today, mm -hmm. uh, people have become uh, sexual to destroy the temple. Yes, that Even is sometimes you see somebody mm -hmm. wearing clothes like a lot. And then she sold, she stole. My dress, my choice. I'm and, allowed to do anything. And then they ask, they, my body. and you know what others say to them? Mm -hmm. If you dress like, dress like that, mm -hmm. they say you are sexy, you look sexy. Yes. Meaning mm -hmm. that thing has become, it is like a normal word. Yes. So they say you look sexy. Mm -hmm. And if you tell some, someone like that, mm -hmm. it means that uh, you are immoral. Yes. That is immorality. Mm -hmm. And the Lord is saying you can't destroy your temple through uh, sex. Yes. He's saying that, uh, sex is, a, is the one of the uh, sin yes. that destroys the temple. Yes. And that temple is our body. Yes. Continue. And 15. they were not made for that work, but they were made for the Lord. And the Lord cares about our bodies. Lord cares about our bodies. But do you know sometimes I do ask people because they say, My body, my choice, or oh, my body, it is my body. Yes. Don't bother about I me. Should dress it the and then I then I, I ask them, them. <laughs> then I ask them, uh -huh. where did you buy your body? Do you have do you have a receipt? Mm -hmm. Because you must have a receipt. Yes. At which supermarket mm -hmm. you bought your body? Mm -hmm. At what price? Mm -hmm. Because you, you found For yourself. You to own it. Yeah, you found yourself growing. Mm -hmm. From a small child, yes. and then the time you become grown up, mm. you start boasting about the Lord. Mm. You boast uh, around. If you are told the, the Lord says stop this, you say it is your body. Mm. That is a very big, big mistake. It's true. Because if God wants to take anybody out of out of, out of this, this world, yes. just a minute, yes. and somebody dies, mm. and it goes to more child. Mm. So we must be very careful while we are talking with the, the name of the Lord. Yes. It is a very big name to be respected. Mm. Hallelujah. Okay, verse 15. Mm -hmm. Don't you realize that your bodies are actually parts of Christ? Yeah, our bodies are part of Christ. Yes. Uh -huh. Should a man take his body, which is part of Christ, and join it to a prostitute? The Lord is talking very frankly. Never. Because some people, they do, uh, they do say, no, mm -hmm. it is my body. Yes. And they don't know Jesus is talking about those bodies. Yes. And he says you cannot take a part of body which is part of Christ mm -hmm. and you make it a, sub, a substance of prostitution. Mm -hmm. It is pro, it is not, uh, God does not agree. Mm -hmm. We must be very careful. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. Mm -hmm. Okay. It says, should a man take his body which is a part of Christ and join it to a prostitute? Mm -hmm. Never. Never. And don't you realize that if a man joins himself to a prostitute, he becomes one body with her? Mm -hmm. For the scriptures say, 
the two are united into one mm -hmm. but the person who is joined to the to the, the lord, lord is one, one spirit. spirit with him mm -hmm. run run from sexual sin no other sin is clearly affects the body or the body mm -hmm. as this one does. Mm. For sexual immorality is a sin against your own body. Mm. Don't you realize that your body is the temple of the Holy Spirit mm. who lives in you mm. and was given to you by God? Mm. You do not belong to yourself. Hallelujah. For God bought you mm. with, the, with a high price. Mm. So you must honor God with your body. Amen. Amen. Now we are talking about the church. Yes. And viewers, we are hearing that the church is your body, my body, other person's body. Yes. So that house, we meet there, be everyone becoming coming there as a church. Yes. And then everybody must make his church holy. Yes. Because that is a church or the temple of the Lord. Mm -hmm. So the Lord comes to deal in, in each, each of our bodies. Yes. And we are told mm -hmm. we cannot use our bodies for sexual uh, substance. Yes. Our bodies must be holy. Because we are united with the Lord, yes. and we become uh, one spirit. Mm -hmm. So we must be very careful mm -hmm. the time we are tackling about uh, the church. Mm -hmm. Because today many people are cheated. Yes. That even go to that house, I'll go and pray very seriously. Mm -hmm. I'll go there and worship very seriously. Yes. I'll go there and uh, lift my hands up. Mm -hmm. I'll go there and kneel down. I'll go there and bow. Mm -hmm. But all that one is nonsense without Holiness. And that is where you can see someone. Yes. Maybe God has sent a preacher, mm -hmm. like the way He sent Jeremiah. Yes. Go and stand at the gate of the church. Yes. Mm -hmm. And preach to the people who are entering inside. Mm -hmm. Now Jeremiah has been said on the on the roads, on the mm -hmm. paths, mm -hmm. on the circles, and in the markets, to tell out the people of God about their sins, or to preach to them. Yeah. But there's someone there who is who has known that. I must be preached there in that house because that is the church. Mm. So so I don't need any other preachings mm. aside from that which my pastor in the church or in that building will give it to me. So let this one does not have a church, let, let him preach to whoever wants to listen. Mm. Now we have been destroyed our minds thinking that there it is where God is. But God dwells in us. Amen. We are the temples. That is why He. We, that is why even we are preaching. Because if it was in a church, we could not be preaching in that building. Yeah. We could not be preaching because there is no one there. Mm. So like now, because we are the temples and God dwells in us, mm. and those our viewers, they yes. are the temples. Mm. God dwells in them. Mm. That is why we are preaching the word of God, so that we may listen to it as temples. We may clean if there's just anything. Dirty. Yes, there's any dirt mm -hmm. that is in our bodies, our temples. We should clean them. Yeah. Yes. And uh, the way we clean it, mm -hmm. it is through the word. Yes. Not by songs. Yes. Because others were singing, mm -hmm. and then Lord told them, uh, away with your songs. Uh, your noisy songs. Others who are praying, and he told them, even if you pray long prayers, mm -hmm. I want the answer. Yes. Others who are fasting and praying, and mm -hmm. then he told them, even if you are fasting, yes. I will not answer your prayers. Yes. And uh, others who are giving offerings, mm -hmm. and he told them, even if you give many offerings, mm -hmm. or, or a lot of uh, offerings, mm -hmm. we will, I will not accept them, mm -hmm. because you are committing sin. Mm -hmm. So we don't know God, because we go to that church to sing. Mm -hmm. We don't know God, because we go to that church to, uh, for prayers. Mm -hmm. We don't know God because we go to that church for Kesha. Mm. The best Kesha yes. is the heart. To make mm. sure your heart is clean. Amen. Because if you destroy the house, God will destroy you. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. The worship, the, the correct worship mm. is to worship God in the spirit yes. and in the truth. Amen. Not about our churches. And for reference, mm. can you read us in the book of John, chapter number 4, verse number 20? John. Yeah. Uh, there's something the, the Samaritan woman told the Lord. Yes. And you want to see what he was saying. Because she was uh, speaking about the church and where they go to worship. But the Lord uh, told him no. Told her no. John 4 and number 20. Yes. 
turned one of the twenty. Yes. So tell me, mm. why is it that you Jewish insist that Jerusalem is the only place of worship, mm. while we Samaritan claim it is here at Mount Gerizim? Mount Gerizim. Yes. Where, Where our, our ancestors worshipped. Amen. Jesus you replied. See, uh, mm -hmm. You see, the woman was saying uh, they worship Samaritans yes. on the mountains. And then uh, Jews believe that Jerusalem is where worship must be done. Yes. But according to the Lord, mm -hmm. he, did not, he did not say uh, about those places. Mm -hmm. There is something he said because we are told our, temp our, our bodies are the temple of the, of the Lord. Yes. And uh, the Spirit of God builds all in, yes. in her. Yes. Then the woman we knew, mm. our church is built on the mountains. Yes. And the churches of Jews are on Jerusalem. So she was trying to compare the two. Mm -hmm. Whereby viewers, you can see, you can listen to you say, I'm a Catholic, I don't care. Yes. But the Lord is not about Catholics. Mm. Maybe you say, I'm a, I, I attend the PCA. Yes. Or I have a redeemed, I got redeemed. Yes. All those names are man-made names. But there is only one name, known as holiness. Hey, that one name, holiness. That name is what the Lord is after. Mm -hmm. He's not after the mega churches or small church mm -hmm. or wherever. Even if you go under the tree mm -hmm. and you are a holy person, yes. the Lord is after you. Yes. Because he wants those uh, holy people, yes. those who are keeping their temple Amen. green. Amen. So continue to, so that you can, you can hear all what the Lord told him. Well, Jesus replied, mm -hmm. believe me, yes. dear woman, mm -hmm. the time is coming when it will no longer matter where, whether you worship the Father on this mountain or mm -hmm. in Jerusalem. Hallelujah. Amen. You Samaritan know very little about one you worship, mm -hmm. while we Jewish know all about him. For salvation comes through the Jews, mm. but it that but the time is coming. Mm. Indeed, it's here now. Mm. When when true worshippers will worship the Father in spirit and in truth. Amen. The Father is looking for those who will worship Him that way. Amen. For God is spirit, mm. so those who worship Him yes. must worship in spirit and in truth. Amen. Amen. So our viewers, uh, praise the Lord. Yes. We continue healing. The answer of Jesus yes. to that woman. Mm. He said, mm. though it is true, you worship in all the mountains mm. and reduce on Jerusalem. But he told the woman, mm. neither worshiping in Jerusalem mm. is enough, yes. nor on the mountains. Mm. So he told her, yes. uh, although salvation came from Jews, mm. but the time is coming. She was saying, the time is. Coming. Coming. Yes. Whereby true worshippers will worship the Lord uh, in truth and, and in spirit. spirit. So we are told we are the temples of the Lord and the spirit of God dwells all in us. in us. So meaning, if you accept God, what he does very simple yes. is to enter in you. Yes. The spirit of God enters into you. Uh, in you. Mm -hmm. For instance, the time the Lord was leaving the world, mm -hmm. as he was a uh, Laughter yes. in Galilee, he told the people, those are those, uh, disciples, don't come out of Jerusalem, mm -hmm. go to the upper room, yes. wait there for the Spirit, mm -hmm. and the Spirit will give you power, mm -hmm. and you will become my witnesses. Yes. So they received the power, mm -hmm. and they went. Mm -hmm. They were uh, pre uh, spreading the gospel, uh, preaching the gospel wherever they went, yes. and people were receiving the power of the Spirit. Yes. So we need the Spirit, yes. we don't need the houses. Mm -hmm. Even if you go inside a hall mm. and you can get the Spirit of God there, mm. it's okay. Yes. But those houses, I do tell people that they are, that they, those are hablerers. Mm. It's like a hablerer uh, to, 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 to protect you from the sun lays. They protect us. Not and lay. Yeah. Not God. They protect human beings from lay and sunshine. Mm. But worship is inside every individual. Mm. To worship the Lord, mm. you must worship the Lord in truth and in spirit. Yes. So the truth comes from the gospel. Yes. And spirit is God himself. So we must be, we must, uh, uh, we must live a life of truth. Yes. And then spirit will come to us and we join truth and spirit. Mm -hmm. Truth is from the word of God. Yes. Spirit is power of God. Yes. Power, that is power. Yes. And then God will come to the person who is living a true life. Yes. Who is a true person. Mm -hmm. 
who is a true worshiper. Amen. Because there are worshippers are true worshippers. Yes. We saw the other day a uh, fake worship worshippers. Yes. Whereby they depend on sing songs, mm -hmm. they depend on prayers, mm -hmm. they depend on giving, mm -hmm. they depend on whatever, fasting and prayers. Mm -hmm. But the true worshippers mm -hmm. are the one who will worship in truth, truth and in spirit. Mm -hmm. In truth and in spirit. Mm -hmm. So that truth comes from the word of God. Can you read the book of John 8 and 31? John 8 and 31. Yes. It says, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Jesus said to the people who believed him, Yes. You are truly my disciple if you remain faithful to my teachings. If you remain, remain faithful to my teachings, yes. you will become true disciples. Yes. So he told them, you are, you are, you are true my disciples. Mm -hmm. If you remain faithful to my teachings, yes. So we get the truth from the word of God. Yes. We become a true worshiper mm -hmm. because okay, we well, get the truth yes. from the word of God. Yes. All the teachings. Yes. Continue. And you will know the truth. Yes. And the truth will set you free. Amen. Yes. So before we meet God, mm -hmm. we must accept God is power. Yes. We must accept Jesus says. Mm -hmm. And if you are accept Jesus Christ, mm -hmm. then now from there you not get to know the truth through yes. his teachings. Yes. Then from there you receive the Holy Spirit. Amen. Because of that truth. Mm -hmm. You believe in the truth. Mm -hmm. Jesus is, is uh, truth mm -hmm. because it's the word of truth. Yes. And he, he was telling them, if you believe in my teachings, mm -hmm. you will become true disciples. Mm -hmm. And then you will come to know the truth. Mm -hmm. And truth shall set you yes. free. Amen. If you are free, you have spirit of God. Mm -hmm. The power enters unto you. Mm -hmm. But without knowing the truth, Amen. there is no way you can become a true disciple. Amen. Today the church knows not the truth. Yes. Knows that is about why in the, the book of Hebrews we have been told yeah. that my people are, are lost because of the lack of knowledge. Yeah. They do not have that knowledge. Yeah. So that is why we are lost saying that in those buildings you can find God, not knowing the truth. And today we have got the truth. Yeah. The truth is that our viewers, praise God. Yes. Our viewers, you must know the truth through the word of God. Yes. The teachings of God. Mm -hmm. About how you are supposed to crop, mm -hmm. how you are supposed to uh, to give, yes. how you are supposed to to, to live, to live, to and then you know what is a sacrifice. Mm -hmm. You know, sometimes uh, we pastors are misleading the church yes. because we are telling them come and sacrifice, sacrifice money, mm -hmm. but that one is not a, a living sacrifice. It is true. Living sacrifice is body. Mm -hmm. Our bodies are the temples of the Lord, mm -hmm. and you must give them, keep them holy. As holy sacrifice. Yeah, if you keep them holy. Now the Lord is there now. You, that is how to enter the, to the holy place. Mm -hmm. That is how to give sacrifice. Mm -hmm. You sacrifice your body, not your money. And that is how to receive the power of God. And that is how to receive salvation. Yes. Because they are saying, I am saved. I am saved. And as we continue, if you have a question, yes. you may ask it. And, and uh, if the broadcast is okay. And if the, you are getting the voice uh, well, we would like to know yes. whether we are coming, uh, we are reaching you well in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Yeah, we, we have known that uh, two worshippers yes. will worship in truth and spirit. Mm -hmm. And then the Lord has told us to know where the truth comes from. Mm -hmm. It is about uh, the word, mm -hmm. teachings of the Lord. Yes. You, 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 are, you are told the word of the Lord, mm -hmm. and then you will become a true worshipper. Yes. And among the spirit, mm -hmm. because we are told God is spirit, mm -hmm. that spirit is the power of God. Mm -hmm. Let us see in the book of uh, uh, Acts of Apostles, chapter 1, verse number 8. Verse number 8. Okay. Acts chapter 1, verse number 8. Yeah. Two. Mm -hmm. But, but you will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes upon you and you will be my witnesses telling people about me everywhere in Jerusalem, throughout Judea, in Samaria, and the ends of the earth. Amen. Amen. So the Lord was telling the disciples, wait upon the Spirit. The spirit the and if, if the Spirit comes, yes. you receive the power. power. So the spirit, God is spirit. Another name is God is power. Yes. So the time you uh, agree the teachings of the Lord, 
the time you become a, 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 a true worshiper, mm -hmm. agree the the, 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 the the truth of the Bible, mm -hmm. of the word, mm -hmm. then you you become a true worshiper. Yes. And then the spirit of God comes mm -hmm. to dwell in you, mm -hmm. to give you the power yes. to continue knowing more about the, the teachings. Amen. Yes. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. I want us also, to, also uh, to see in the book of Psalms, mm -hmm. uh, chapter number 51, mm -hmm. and verse number 17. Yes. My sacrifice is a broken spirit, a broken and contrite heart. Mm -hmm. You, God, will not despise. Yes. The sacrifice which God wants mm -hmm. is a broken spirit. Mm -hmm. That is meaning humble spirit yes. and contrite heart person who is humbled, mm -hmm. somebody who is broken in the spirit, mm -hmm. somebody who will humble. And to humble is not just to be quiet for a long time. To humble is to accept what the Lord is saying. <laughs> yeah, not, not walking in the small slow motion, not uh, conducting prayers with a little poise. No, it is accepting what the Lord is saying. Yes. That is how to, that is how to, to humble. Mm -hmm. Yes. I mean, and there, there you have seen verse 16. Mm -hmm. uh, you have said verse 17. 17. Uh, it also says, The sacrifice you desire is a broken spirit. Mm -hmm. You will not reject a broken and repentant heart. Oh, my God. God. Yes. Repentant heart. Yes. Somebody who is ready to say, I have been going wrong, and today I'm ready to, 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 to go back to the, the ways of the Lord. Because today the church has, has, has gone astray. Mm. People are taught about sacrifices, giving money, mm. not giving the heart. Yes. And the Lord is saying, the sacrifice of the Lord is humbled heart, repentant heart. But today, that one is not in the church. That's why the church has, is broken. The church is dead. Mm. The church is not uh, walking in the ways of the Lord. Yes. Because the problem are the pastors. Mm. Because you want them to come with sacrifice. Others have a lot of services. Every Sunday has a, a name of the service. Mm. Sacrificial giving. Come and dedicate your job. Dedicate your family. Mm. Dedicate your, your, your houses. Mm. Dedicate your mothers. Dedicate your children. Every Sunday has a name, dedication. a nickname. Yeah, dedication services. Mm. Sacrificial giving. Mm. Those things are out. Mm. And also in generational curses. <laughs> yes. You are saved. And then you go to your pastor, and then he says, I can see you have a generational cast. Your grandfather cast your you. Name. Your name is not good, the name you are called. Things, they are very many, many things they have, which are said in my pastors, but they are misreading the congregation. Yes. I pray to the Lord that pastors may change mm -hmm. because they are misleading the problem. Sure. Telling them they have generational curses, mm -hmm. telling them the, 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 the name they were called telling them about, I don't know, whatever, whatever, a lot of nonsense, mm -hmm. which does not come from the Lord. Mm -hmm. Because Jesus was here for three years. Yes. There's no way, there's there's no, even a single day, mm -hmm. he conducted a service known as dedication. dedication. There's no, even a single day, mm -hmm. Jesus was selling oil. There's no a single day, Jesus was selling salt. Yes. Wherever he went, yes. there's no a day, Jesus was saying generational curses. Mm -hmm. Lord came and said, Depend of your sins. Yes. The kingdom is near. Mm. Only that. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Yes. Uh, we are continuing, uh, almost uh, ending up. Mm. And uh, we want to say that, viewers, it is good that you are listening. It is good that you are hearing the voice of the Lord. And we pray that the Lord will continue uh, helping you through this broadcast. Whatever, whatever the Lord comes before you, Ask yourself, why is it that the Lord has come to give me this message? Why is it that the Lord has come to help me through this message? Yes. And then you take your time, and then you, you, you accept that the Lord is doing something at you. Hallelujah. Amen. So I think we, can finish. Uh, yeah. we are almost uh, heading up. Yes. And uh, crossing word. Yes. Our closing word it is that we have known what is the church, mm. and the church it is law the building, yes. but the church is me and you, mm. and we must keep our churches clean. Mm. The way we go to wash 
the churches where we go, we believe those buildings, the way we wash them, the way we make them clean, the yes. way we we paint them to be so smart, to be so attractive. Mm. So let us wash our table, our, our temples, our churches, which is me and you. Mm. If you are a lady, mm. let us wash ourselves Amen. to be clean, to be somewhere where God can dwell. Amen. Amen. So viewers, we are done for, yes. for your company. And I do say this. Maybe you can listen with us as we continue, and then you fail to get it correctly. Yes. It is good that you can leave it. And then make sure you share to others. Share this message. Become also part and parcel yes. of this broadcast. Yes. Wherever you get it, make sure you share to somebody else. You can tell your neighbor, your sister, your relative, can you hear this message? Yes. Because if you do so, you are working together with us for the Lord. Yes. And then we pray for you viewers that together we can learn to know the Lord well and we become true worshippers. Because the word has told us, the Lord is seeking, he is seeking the true worshippers. And who are true worshippers? The people who worship in truth, whereby the truth came from the word and in spirit, whereby the spirit is the power of the Lord. Of the Lord. If you believe in, the Jesus Christ, in Jesus Christ, he will give you that power of the spirit Amen. and then you will be able to, uh, to cope with the salvation. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Yes. So let me apologize just maybe for a slight mistake which has been there. Mm. Maybe the the pictures are not seen well. Mm. It is because of the network problem. Yeah. But we'll check on it. Mm. But I believe as we began, it was okay. Yes. So because we have finished, let us see you tomorrow. Yes. Let us believe and pray. Amen. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, we oh, thank yes. you once more because mm. you have been with us. You have guided us, oh God. Mm. You have spoken to our hearts, to our spirit, to these churches. You have spoken unto them, Lord. Mm. Thank you, King of Glory. Yes, thank Lord. you for letting us to know that we are the churches that you need to dwell in, mm. that you need to, to live in. Mm. Lord Jesus, we thank you. Help every church who has listened to this message mm. that you may get to, 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 to be transformed, that mm. you may get to know you more and more. Let us, Lord Jesus, know how to walk oh, with yes. your ways. Let us know how to worship mm. in truth and in spirit, oh, as yes. you told that human mm. in the mighty name of Jesus. Mm. Lead us, O oh God, be yes. with us, King of Glory. Mm. Every viewer be with everyone in mm. the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, this yes. broadcast, we just place it unto your own hands. Mm. That, Lord Jesus, you may continue. Keep us going because you are God mm. and there is none like you. Oh, yes. And it is in your mighty name of Jesus we pray, believe, and trust in. Amen. Amen and amen. So shalom until tomorrow, the same time, Jesus.